hello guys um welcome back to my channel i just finished posting a one second okay i just finished um not just finished because by the time you guys see this my last video would have been last week so if you haven't watched my last youtube channel please do so there i am speaking about just you know mental health awareness you know working on yourself spiritually and things like that just go over and watch that first before watching this video for those who are new i am a single mom of six kids i adopted five of my nieces and nephews and i birthed this little one right here looking like he's mad um i just wanted to take you guys along i have different areas in my home where they are just cluttered let me tell you cluttered up so i just want to kind of like declutter i want to go through things um there is my closet bathroom where i have tons of stuff where i just don't even use and it's just sitting there so i just want to go through everything and get rid of what i don't use and i just want to bring you guys along with me if in case you guys have any cluttered areas in your house and you need some motivation to declutter this is what i'm here for <laughs> so um make sure you guys like comment and subscribe before you continue watching this video thank you guys i'm almost at a thousand subscribers <laughs> I just love that I'm growing every time I go to like, you know, because I watch my own videos. Every time I go back to watch my own videos, I see myself growing and I just get so excited. And I wish there was like a way where we can all meet or maybe do like a Q&A. Hopefully, and I think most of you guys are following me on Instagram. Maybe one day I'll post like, you know, um maybe i'll post you know something on my instagram story saying that you know i'm gonna do a q a if you guys have any questions let me know let me know here so that i can answer them in my youtube video so let's get into the video guys these are just things that ends up up there when i clean the living room that doesn't belong in the living room and just ends up staying there so in front of my microwave is my favorite place to kind of toss things there and keep it moving so i'm going to clear all that up there Tell me my shirt was dirty. This was my son crying and putting all his snotty nose on me. Excuse the appearance, guys. Mama on full effect. Let me tell you. All right. Mom. Yes. I did not kiss the boy in the party. Okay. I kicked her around the side. Why are you supposed to kick anyone? I didn't kick her by I didn't kick her on purpose. You kicked her by mistake? I was training and then she went next to me and then I accidentally hit her. Did you apologize? Yes. Okay. I'll be getting I'll be getting interrupted, guys. Alright. Let's talk about this bathroom. Please, let's talk about this bathroom. Let's talk about my bathroom yes and no my bathroom is not always like this it's been like this for the last couple of days i've been ignoring it okay if you sorry you guys i'm like fixing myself while i talk to you guys if you guys have anxiety and any kind of depression you know what i mean when things just sometimes happen <laughs> nah but for real for real um my, my bathroom is not always like this it's just like right now so this is why i have you guys you guys are gonna motivate me to declutter to clean and whatnot so let's get this counter clean whenever i'm in a dark place cleaning organizing and decluttering helps me feel better and not even in a dark place necessarily just whenever I feel like there's a lot going on, is cleaning and organizing and decluttering just makes me feel good overall. Makes it feel like everything is in control and at its point. I'm going to organize all of this and looking at it, just it's just literally giving me a headache. So let me see what I'm gonna do. 
So what I did here is I divided everything in its own bin. I have a bin for the beads and rubber bands. I have a bin for scrunchies only. I have a bin for bows, a bin for headbands. Yeah, it's that serious, but it helps and I can find what I need and the kids too. Let me tell you, when I was done with this part, I felt so great. You have no idea. You guys have to try this. If you have a closet that just has a bunch of stuff in it, it could be a linen's closet, it could be a closet like this, and you know there's stuff in there that you haven't used in months upon months, go through it. Go through it and ask yourself, have I used this in the last 6 to 12 months? If the answer is no, Get rid of it. You don't necessarily have to throw it away. You can give it to a friend, a family member, if it's in good condition or like not expired or stained. Talking about for the linen part. But trust me, you're going to feel so much better because it's going to be so much room in that closet that you're working on. And it's kind of like a mental thing, but at least for me, it's a mental thing. You know, I feel like I'm making room in my mind and my life for better and new things to come along. Guys, you have to try it. Trust me, you're gonna feel good. Right, guys i'm finally done i am so glad that i was able to tackle those things that i've been meaning to tackle days ago i am happy that you guys basically were here with me while i decluttered everything you know it just feels good to get those areas done that i've been meaning to do days ago it's just i just haven't had the energy to do so but i want to thank you guys for watching this video i hope you guys enjoyed it don't forget to like comment and subscribe guys and i'll see you guys in the next one Bye.